The most powerful thing in After Effects isn't an effect or plugin. It's actually this. And let me show you why. A null object can be treated as an empty container that holds neutral values. This means you can apply any data you want to it, which makes it extremely powerful. So just how do we use it? One of the best uses of a null object is parenting. This allows me to move existing animated layers within my project without affecting the animation or having to redo anything. For instance, if I try to move these two layers around, it's going to cause a lot of issues within my animation. However, if I create a null object and parent these layers to it, then move the null object, it will keep all my animation the same, but allow me the freedom of repositioning or rescaling my layers. This is such an easy way to move things around your scene without completely ruining your hard work. Null parenting also works great on After Effects cameras too. After Effects cameras can be an absolute minefield to move around and change. In my opinion, it's much easier to use After Effects cameras when they're parented to a null object. For example, I have my camera and I parent this to a null with the 3D layer switch enabled. By then changing the rotation and position parameters on my null, it makes it much easier to control my scene and alter my camera data. It makes it much easier to alter my frame without affecting where the camera is actually looking. Nulls offer great flexibility when used as a master controller for effects as well. For instance, if I have a scene and have multiple layers using the same colour, I can actually control these through a null. It makes it much quicker to change effects based on feedback or if I just have a different feel I'm going for. Now, of course, this doesn't apply just to fills and it can work for a bunch of effects. So it's great to experiment. All we have to do is apply our effect to the null, select this in our effect controls and go to edit and select copy with relative property links. I then want to paste this to any layers that I want to have that same effect. Now I can control each layer's colour with just a single null. You can of course combine master nulls and effect nulls, but realistically I use different ones for different things. It just makes it much easier if someone else was to go into your project and needed to change things. You can also use nulls as expression controllers, and you can learn more about that by watching this video here.